Hi, my name is Latrice Crawford, and I am the building coordinator for Purdue Polytechnic High School in the Indiana GEARA program. Today, I will be covering scholarships and why they are important um, to help students pay for college. Scholarships provide an opportunity for many people to earn an education. Without assistance from an outside source, many students may have trouble paying for the degree they need in order to enter the workforce and become a contributing member of society. Scholarships are money is money that does not have to be paid back. It can be awarded based on merit, need, skills, hobbies, family history, and athletics. You wanna apply for as many scholarships as possible. You wanna make sure you search various scholarship websites, books, local organizations, churches, family employers, and nonprofits. Most scholarships will require that you have a brilliant essay written. And we will discuss some tips later in the presentation on things that you can do to make sure that your essay is competitive among your peers. Scholarship money does not have to be paid back and is given without consideration of financial means. You can earn scholarships for various reasons. You've got good grades, great point average, maybe some personal accomplishments, volunteering, you've demonstrated leadership, and scholarships can be based on race, residency, or disadvantaged status. Some places you should start looking for scholarships. Start locally within your town and state, community-based organizations and foundations. Look into the local businesses in your city or state. Ask your high school counselor for resources as it pertains to scholarships. Look into special interest groups. And any college that you're looking to attend, there will always be a list of scholarships available. So start looking into different colleges and looking into their website and doing your research. This is a list of local college and scholarship resources. Learn More Indiana, College Go Week, College Go Sunday, Cash for College, and Indiana College Cost. Those are just some websites that you should get very familiar with that will list a bunch of resources that will be very valuable for you finding information about college. Where can you find scholarships in Indiana? There, there are lots of scholarship programs available just for Hoosier students. Each has its own requirements, but you should apply for all you are eligible for. That way you can be sure to get the maximum amount of scholarship assistance to help you pay for college. This is a list that contains some national scholarship resources. FASTWeb, Big Future, Finite, UNCF, and www.scholarships.com are just a few websites that you can go on and create an account for free, get signed up, and there will be a lot of scholarship opportunities that are on this website. So I highly suggest you to sign up for an account on these websites and start looking for scholarships. This is another scholarship website, collegeexpress.com. It lists 45 of the weirdest college scholarships. As you can see here, these are scholarships that don't pertain to academics or GPA or SAT or ACT scores. So go to collegeexpress.com Maybe there's a skill, an interest, or a hobby that you have that will make you eligible for applying to these scholarships. So things you can do to make your scholarship application stand out, maintain solid grades, score well on the SAT and ACT, have a personal statement or essay that's uh, tied to your accomplishments and application requirements. Be prepared to rock out your interview and to really hone in on your creativity skills.
some tips that you can take to make sure that your essay is good. You wanna make sure that you share your career goals in your essay. Talk about the different experiences you've had in life. Make sure that your essay demonstrates your passion, showcase your leadership skills, and speaks about your class involvement. You wanna make sure you stay within the essay parameters. And then always make sure you have a parent, teacher, or counselor proofread your essay before you turn it in. Final tips, remember to check the scholarship deadlines. Every scholarship has a deadline in which you have to have your application and essay in. Bye. Double check everything that you're submitting and never pay for a scholarship or to complete your FAFSA. It's completely free. If you are on a website that requires you to pay, it is a scam. Get off of that website. You don't have to pay for scholarships. This concludes this section of our presentation. If you have any questions, you can contact me at the email listed below.